For some reason, I have gambling friends, and I tag along sometimes. I didn't care about gambling. She's running good, man. She's running like a champion, baby. Doesn't even have the whip out. Go to the window. Who are the odds on this one? She's on the rebound. Maybe the kiss was that. Maybe it wasn't. I'm sick of thinking of this every second. You see, I told you, they left her alone because of her last race. She won for fun. See this? I got flunked up in the try. I got shut out, man. Robbie's Iranian. Somehow he gambles heavily and all the time, despite having maxed out his credit cards and skipping out on his landlord. There's a warrant on him for unpaid parking tickets. He had to put phony plates on his car. Now he parks anywhere he wants, and he gets a new ticket every day. But it doesn't matter, because the tickets are wrong. 15 to 1? 9 to 2, they're pounding it. OK. OK, good, give me five bucks. Perfect. It's the only speed, just go wire to wire. See, Shane, you got action, look what's happening. 50 bucks was more than I could afford, which made it even less about the money. That fucking thing died. Fucker! Uh, uh. Seen that before, man. Yeah, show me a happy loser, I'll show you a loser. I was sitting there. So sit over there. I don't want to sit over there. Why'd you take my seat? Fuck for? you, asshole. You're on the phone. I need the table to roll reefers. Yes! Fuck yes! yes! Hey. Quick hands, eh? Oh, he's great! Hey, is that Spazito Italian? Is that what you like him? No, he's Iranian. Hello? Yeah, uh, yeah. Ma, I'm going to go to the park. I'm Italian. Check this no. out. This is funny. Yeah, don't want to sit. No. No, 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 Hey, Vittorio, your hookers are here. What are they say? It's the one with the big tits. No, you think I'll have a the chain. And the guy's blaming me because he can't buy his kids Christmas gifts. It's weird, eh? I get paid basically to help people ruin their lives. You feel guilty? Oh, the guy was an asshole. Man, Canada's all over these guys. Yeah, you see, Wop? You should have bet with us. Shaner's gonna make it 20. So I'm happier than you just watching it. I don't need to bet. Happier than you. What a dick. What time is it, anybody? Does anybody have the time? Mahavlich, come on! He's the shittiest conductor. He make us rehearse five hours, anything. You ever heard the Warsaw Concerto? I don't know, man. Well, you know what a piece of shit is. Who cares? I hope Canada loses. Because you're an asshole. Why don't you care about your own country? Because I want everyone to be miserable. <laughs> Fucking guy. I gotta go feed a cat. Hey, make me tea first. So, you meet the bank on Monday or? Hey, Vittorio, make me some tea. Make your own tea? What, you can't do it yourself? Make me tea. Try getting out of your chair. It's not that hard. It is. I'm too tired to get up. Oh, so go to bed. Well, I won't have to if I get some tea. Well, yeah. Well, I gotta go to work. Well, come on, Dick. Just put the water on then. Get it. I'm not doing it. Jesus, what an amazing idiot. I'm kind of done in, eh? I bet I can get him to make the tea. Two bucks. I can't do this aimless crap right Two now. Two bucks? Come on, bet me. <sighs> Fine. I think you'll do it. Two bucks? No. I give you two to one. I'll take two to one. What, for me? Yeah, I'm betting against myself. Two to one you give me. Okay. Okay. Vittorio, <laughs> make the tea, man. No, don't! <laughs> Wait, you just bet? Yeah, I think I know. Did you put the water on, asshole? No, I didn't. Woo! <laughs> Four bucks. Come on. What a move! That's it. And Shane, you get two. Sharp shooter. What? 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 What the fuck? What? I bet him a douche you'd make the tea and him the other way at two to one. So? So, fuck you. So if I made the tea, you would have won fuck all. You would have beat him and you just lose it to him. Yeah, but I can't lose. You take a bet like that anytime. You figured that out instantly. That's kind of weird. Same age as a bookie. And yeah, we should make ourselves bookies. I'm serious. Yeah, man, let's do it. Wait. We're doing it. Okay. Oh, shut up. No, you're not. 
This is just a bunch of more bullshit. You talk about it, then you never do it. Why do you even talk about it? What a dink you are. Go to work. Hey, how do you become a bookie? By saying you're one. Tell guys you'll book their bets, they call you, and then you're, you're a bookie. Why not us? Yeah? What if the guys don't pay you? Hmm? What are you gonna do then? Huh? Nothing. We're not loan sharks, fuckface. You know what? Don't say anything. All your negativity is just bad. No, no, no. This is good, man. Yeah, I know. Because you're not gambling. Mm. You have the same amount on both teams in whatever game. And your juice, that's 10% of every single bet, goes in your pocket. Why didn't we think of this before? I don't know. Well, I'm out. Truly, I am. But I will make you some tea. Shin, make me tea, too? Be kind. Thank you very much. Yeah, don't tell anyone. So you're in, all right? We're going to make money. Sorry, I'm not. Now, bookmaking seems like a step backward somehow. <laughs> Andrew, a guy came in on me in the fucking shower for Bill. Come on, Andrew. They came in on you in the shower? When? You come on, Shane. So I learned from Robbie, who took the action. It was 550 to win 500 in Canada. No one could bring themselves to admit that the Soviets were actually better. So the money poured in on Canada. We couldn't stop it. All the phone did was ring. Robbie liked how things were going, and I barely even understood what was happening. Hope he's a pick and even money. Canada in possession. Here's Fort Y.A. The score? How much action we get? He's adding it. Vittorio. Time's up, man. 400 gets you in, baby. See what they add up. Look at him. Too cheap to take the risk, too greedy not to, going crazy. Okay, let's hear it. Okay, this is a little bit different. 200 Russia, 10,000 Canada. Fuck you. 200 Russia, 10,000 Canada. Oh my god, you moron, you're lying. Oh my god! Okay, I'm out. <sighs> Canada! Look how stupid you are, we're gonna lose $10,000! You can't, they, they all wanted Canada. So lay it off, Robbie, do you know what a phone is? Yeah, I know what the yeah, phone is, Yeah, you know is, the but... phone, you pick it up and you dial fucking numbers and you cover our ass, you bet Canada with Finbar! And Shane, what were you doing? Were you watching? He wants to gamble. He just fucked us. No, 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 no. I did call Finbar. He only take maximum 3,000. So fuck Finbar. Andrew, 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 Andrew. It's okay. The Russians are good. They're very good. They can win, man. We had the urge to leave the room. Russia was down three goals and was going to lose. This isn't that easy to believe. This would finish me off. All ready for the face-off. Part Y.A. moves out of position on the first move. Quick pass to Federate. One man back. And Trump getting it back to clean off. Right in front of the The Soviets are back in the game. So what? Who cares? There's one anyway. Three to one for Canada. Got it back into his own zone. Jackson gets it again. Stay behind. Stop. Andrew, what do we do? Nothing. We have to win, but we're not going to. See, they're doing it, man. Don't say anything. And in a couple of minutes, right off the bat, they're in a lot of trouble. All I want is a tie. Get me out of this. No kidding. No, I'm getting tired of this. It's always the big nets, right? And oh yeah, since when is breaking even supposed to be this miracle? When does one finally just tell God to give me what I ask for because it's me and I'm telling you to do it? I am announcing right now that I will be ungrateful for a tie. Want to sit down, buddy? I will hate breaking even. I want a win. Because it's right. Nothing less. Am I clear? 
I was betting against the foundation of my country's faith. Treason, basically immoral. Sorry. Hello. Go me. We won 9,000 on game five, and three of it was mine. Constant updates of scores over the ticker tape. We also had a blackboard. I forget where we got that. It was just numbers, big numbers, flying around in all directions. This was gambling, all right. Gambling always. Five, one, fifty. One ten to win a hundred. Huge risks were being taken every two minutes, and everything mattered. Okay. A guy just put five Gs on Canada to win game eight. What? What the hell are you doing? Lay it off, Robbie, the whole thing. Call Finbar right now. Fine, I'm calling Finbar right now. Get rid of that bet. Yeah. Get rid of that bet. I know. A penalty, turn it up. That was Palomar. Right See that bunch of dirty Canadian assholes? We're going to get stuck six bills in this one. Part of the game, man. Shut, Shut up. your face. What? That's the way you play hockey, man. That's not the way you play sports. Part of the game, yeah, absolutely. Valerie Karlamov was the Soviet's best player and had been killing Team Canada for the whole series. In the second period of Game 6, Bobby Clark addresses the problem by breaking Karlamov's ankle, effectively putting him out of the series. Tough player, it's right. Oh, you're a tough guy. Now. Yeah, I'm a tough guy. Oh, are you, oh are you a tough guy? Team Canada wanted this. Oh, tougher than me. Please. Fuck you. Please. Come. Both of you shut up. I'm trying to fucking watch this game. They're going to win. Fuck, I hate hockey. Turn it off. Tear yourself off. Leave the room. I'm going to get racing forms. Anyone want cigarettes? Asshole. Asshole! Asshole! I never saw Robbie again. It just happens with the hardcore guys. They disappear sometimes. Funny thing, we expected him in 10 minutes. 